and welcome to this video. What are superfoods? How did this term get created? Top 10 superfoods, their benefits, and some simple recipes for superfoods. Let us uncover all this, these questions in this video. Two key terms to note here are, delivers the greatest number of nutritional advantages while having minimal calories. part of 20th century where it started as a marketing tactic for bananas. I'm sure you will agree that bananas are a favorite food for many and these days bananas can be combined with so many food elements that it would be it would need a separate video to list them all. Now let us dive into the top 10 natural superfoods. I have kept focus on plant-based mainly nine of them are plant-based let's start with first with garlic hippocrates who is also considered the father of modern medicine prescribed garlic for a wide range of conditions and illnesses key benefit consumption of garlic and its allyl sulfur compound reduces incidences of cancer Garlic is also very well known for its antimicrobial effects and one of the studies showed that it was more effective than antibiotics in fighting some bacteriums. The second superfood is berries. Berries are known to be loaded with antioxidants and antioxidants as we all know help in fighting free radicals reducing the damages to our body. The third superfood in our list is cruciferous vegetables, mainly the cabbage family and the edible members of this family are called cruciferous vegetables. Certain enzymes in these veggies may help protect cell DNA from damage and have antioxidant properties. One very interesting call out for this superfood is it can contract cancer causing substances, hydrocarbons that are found in charred, cured or barbecued fish or meats, fish or meats that have been overcooked and got charred or burnt. The fourth superfood is leafy greens, which can be either dark or light in color and include spinach, romaine, kale and so on. Kale is considered one of the most nutrient dense vegetables on the planet due to many vitamins, minerals and antioxidants. Fifth superfood in our list is legumes, mainly the beans, which are considered superfood because they are one of the most nutritious foods you can eat.
for sixth superfood are nuts such as hazelnuts walnuts almonds and pecans which are excellent sources of protein derived from plants Now let us add a cooking oil which is the extra virgin olive oil because oil is required everywhere it's a superfood and a natural source of vitamin E one saturated fatty acids and so on Next in our list is tomatoes and tomatoes you would have heard a lot about helping the risks of pro developing prostate cancer Next in our list is yogurt which is one of my favorites I dev create yogurt at my home it's a unique superfood contains live cultures called probiotics which are good for stomach and aid in digestive system and the last one is fish packed with essential nutrients high in protein low in bad fats fish is supposed to be a very healthy source of omega 3 which is an essential nutrient for brain health and many many other benefits let us now look into how to obtain and prepare these superfoods a few simple recipes let's start with berries 